Hi, I'm Bonnie Smith for Paper Wizard PKC, here to introduce to you the kits for the month of November. And of course, since Thanksgiving's in November, we went a little on the turkey side. Let's talk about Give Thanks with Grateful Hearts. This is our main kit for the month of November. I'm gonna lift it up and Eric, come on in and show them this cute title with this bird. Cause you know, bird is the word. <laughs> So we have this brand new super cute title with this darling turkey in his little pilgrim hat. We've got gorgeous papers that we're using. We've got pumpkins and ears of Indian corn and leaves, everything. Look at this pumpkin pie down here too. And we've got this gorgeous doodle bug background paper and accent paper, the Buffalo check. All right, now I wanna point out something. I wanna put this down. I'm gonna come around and I wanna show you this cute bird. Look, he's ready for dinner. And I almost had him have a sign that says, you know, eat ham, but <laughs> that was a little too Chick-fil-A for me. So we had this, but this cute, cute bird and he's just so darling. He's ready to attend the big dinner with all the family and friends. And just to accent that, we've got these sweet little doilies up here. We've cut them in half backed them with a little bit of the white shimmer paper to make them stand out more and topped them with pumpkins on pop dots. Oh yes, you heard me, I love pop dots. And then we have just like this, this little spray here with the cute little pumpkin and all the little extras. And if you can see cl up close at this paper, this is one of my favorite things that Doodlebug does. That tone on tone is really effective for a background paper, and it's one of my favorite things. And then, of course, this cute, busy buffalo check is the perfect accent. It makes everything look fresh and just bright and not at all dull. So we had a lot of fun with this, and I thought it was the cutest thing, and the turkey was so cute that I took it to the next level. Well, when I say I, we took it to the next level. This little menu with this bird with the chef hat here is adorable and you can write your menu out and it does come with a backer to help it stand up. Now you can write that out and then on each of these little guys, you can put a name or you could put the name right here and then have them what they're, write what they're thankful for. And then you can then flatten the back out or take the backer off and put it flat in your scrapbook with a picture of the person who used it. And I think that would just be darling. In fact, I think that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so we do have some with pilgrim hats, and then we have some with chef hats. So, and there's six in the set. And if you need more, you can get more than one set. Now, the, the best thing about this is this is gonna ship out early. This will ship by November 10th. We are going to be making these and sending these out as you order them so that we know you have them in time to assemble them and get them ready for your table. But check this out. Then you're gonna pick, take a picture of your table using all these, and then you're gonna put it on your layout. Oh, genius, right? I just think that's so cool. Plus, if you really like them and you don't wanna put them in your layout, you can keep them year after year and just um, have fun with them. If you do that, I do recommend maybe high gloss or some sort of a Mod Podge on top of it. Just be careful with that. Or show them how the stands come off. Well, okay, well you've got it taped here to make sure that I don't knock it over. Okay. So this is what we do to make sure that we don't knock them over, but, but you can pull, the you can pull all the way off this right off. And put them in your book. So. And you can put it in your book flat, just like that. Oh. See, and if you have little kids who like to knock things over, um, I recommend the tape. <laughs> yeah, it's good. <laughs> because, you know, I'm like a little kid and I knock things over. And that's why Eric taped that for me to make sure that I didn't. Now, I, I know you guys know that I'm a little bit of, just a little bit of a Friends fanatic. Okay, not fanatic, but fan for sure. And so I've been just jonesing to do a Friendsgiving layout or title. And so we finally did one. So here is Friendsgiving, the one where they ate turkey. And you got to love it. It is adorable. It looks very similar, of course, to the title um, on the main kit. And you can use this on the main kit if you want. And we've got these cute frames and the cute couch. Now the frames and the couch, for those of you who've been with us, were in the Friends kit before, 
but these are a little bit different size. These are not the same size, so I don't want to be misleading. But look at my favorite part. Oh, who remembers Monica in the turkey with the hat doing her little booty shake? <laughs> shimmy. First she did a little shimmy, then she did a little booty shake. And then Chandler said he loved her. So there you go. That's adorable. It is so cute. And I think it would be so much fun on a page. And just in case you want to do this and this, and you think you might need more paper, guess what? Paper girl, I got more paper. Let me show you. So here we go. So in order to recreate this again, you're going to need two sheets of the background paper, which we have here, uno dos. So there's two sheets. And then we've given you a whole sheet of the Buffalo check because hello, it's so cute, why not? And then we have this Darling Cinnamon, and this is a textured cardstock. This is from Doodlebug as well. I really love the textured cardstock. And we also have these fun papers from My Mind's Eye. Again, this is textured. This is called Brown Eyes. It's a very rich brown, almost an espresso. And then we've got this, this is a recycled paper, so you can see the flex in it, which I think makes it so interesting. And it's a nice 80 pound cover weight. So that's a beautiful paper. And of course, one of my favorites, the Riche Shine. Beautiful paper. And My Mind's Eye, more from them, both Mandarin and Sweet Potato. And look how well this goes with the layout. I mean, it just matches everything. So this is the paper pack this month. So if you need more, and if you're like me and you always want extra paper, then that's something that's an option for you. Now, for those of you who are new to our club, the paper pack is always optional and the add-ons are always optional. So it's just things we think you might like. And let me reiterate though, that the menu and these little guys are all going to be shipped out by November 10th, which means you've got to get your orders in so that we can get these to you as quickly as possible so that you can make them and have them ready for your Thanksgiving day table. Now, just because it's Thanksgiving doesn't mean that we skipped on our alt kit. We're gonna say goodbye to give thanks for a minute and we're going to show you something that is not orange, not yellow, not fall colored at all, but so cute. You guys, thank you for being a friend. Some of the things we are thankful for, especially this year, are our friends. They give us our sanity, they keep us whole, and they help us get through this crazy pandemic. So, if you have friends like that, you may want to just make this lay little layout. Let's take a look. Now, this is so cool. Look at this cute girl. She is on the phone with her girlfriend. And guess where they are? There they are. There she is. I can talk. We've got this darling, beautiful shimmer paper, glorious title, brand new. And then we have this glossy old style telephone. I actually remember my grandmother having one of those. My mom's was the next one up. Not much better, really, but avocado green, actually, as opposed to black. Then look at this typewriter. Isn't that beautiful? This thing is so cool. Wait till you see how it comes together. Eric was a genius when he made this, when he drew it and put it together. We got a little touch of purple here. You gotta love that. Then we've got some flowers coming out from behind because, you know, color, pretty, we like it. And it says, hello. I just think that's darling. And if you don't like the hello, you could actually put a little note in there. You could do a little journaling, just switch it out. We've got the darling striped photo play paper. Love the stripes. And this background paper. Now you might think I just used cardstock. I didn't just use cardstock. I used my mind's eye, my colors bling cardstock. So it has that light dusting of, well, <clears throat> pixie dust, <laughs> fairy dust. It sparkles, it shimmers, it shines. It's so beautiful. And then of course we've got the little photos, corners, the faux photo corners, and this beautiful letter box over here. This is pop dotted up and you can kind of move these in or out or not. And you can put the bouquet in there. You can put little love letters in there. You can put little notes or you can even stuff it full of pictures of you and your besties. I just think this is the cutest retro kit we've ever done. And I'm in love with it. So, 
And of course, you might have more friends that need to be pictured. And so if you do, we have a few more papers. So we've got, of course, two of the frosty pink, because this is your background paper. And then we have one of the pink delight glimmer. And then if you just cut this, you can make triangles. But if you don't want to do that, you don't have to. So I gave you the whole sheet. It's really something that you can decide. And of course, we've got the photo play stripe. And then we've got our basics over here that just kind of set everything off. So this is available as an option. And that is our alt kit. Thank you for being a friend. So we're filled with gratitude this month in more ways than one. I'm so grateful that uh, we can get together as a family, that my three sons are here with us. And we are so grateful to be able to continue working with and for you guys. Um, we've been immeasurably blessed, not just by life situation, but by our customers and our business. It's our 20th birthday, our 20th anniversary today, October 30th. And after 20 years of being in business, all I can say is to all our customers, thank you. You've been behind us, you've stood with us, you've given us suggestions, you've cheered us on and you've stood up for us and we appreciate you so very much. Thank you so much for all you've done for us and for you know continuing to give us feedback, to supporting us and to buying our products. So all I wanna say now is happy Thanksgiving. <laughs>